Peace, everybody. This is Thomas Amal with another edition of Conversation Corner. I am sitting outside on the deck area of my house. The weather is really nice in Chicago today. It's about almost, it's probably 80 degrees right now, and it's already maybe 9 o'clock in the morning. But something that I was listening to uh, and pertaining to uh, the laws of attraction, and it was what, uh, something that I thought was really apropos, it's something that I actually uh, like, and I thought maybe I should share with you all. One of the things is called the Callahan Technique. Um, and the Callahan Technique is when you're feeling bad, just really down in the dumps, is some people have the uh, ability to go for acupuncture. And what you do is you go and you have them tap on the acupuncture meridian points um, within the body. And what that does is it dissipates um, that depressed or negative feeling that that person may have that in that vibration or energy that you have that you're leading off or that you're giving off with that bad feeling, it dissipates, it eliminates, and it doesn't come back. Now, that's for that particular instance. Now, you know, you may feeling come uh, uh, start feeling bad about something else at a later date, then you go back again. So this is something that's recurring uh, from my understanding, and the, the Callahan technique is something that uh, many people do take advantage of and being that I have been to acupuncture I haven't gone in a couple of years and I keep considering going back I think that's one of the things especially with some of the issues that are going on um, that my life that I am changing from negative and making a positive out of it I would like to use every vehicle in my t reach to help me eliminate all of the negative vibrations and the negative energy that I have because there's too many things um, that's going on in this world uh, it's too many uh, opportunities. Life is short and no one wants to walk around being unhappy and negative and mad all the time. It's just not going to happen. Not in my life um, and not for me and those around me. Another area uh, which was discussed was called dream building. Now myself, I have what's called a dream board. I mean, I'm sorry, a, 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 a vision board. And I have a number of things on it that I want, that I've wanted and I desire almost all of my life and many of the things that have come up over the last couple of years and I put them all on a board so I have them on my cell phone I have them I can go get them anywhere and I just see it constantly um, some people use magazines some people use uh, they might just drive through various neighborhoods and see the house that they love but one of the aspects of that dream building is for instance touching it touching it and feeling it brings that energy to you to where you may it may help you get to that dream or whatever you're trying to aspire for uh, to a lot faster. Now it's gonna happen over time, don't get me wrong, it's not like if you go touch that new car, you're gonna get that new car tomorrow. Um, but it's an attractive force and it links you with that attractive force um, with you and it starts that process, it makes it more real, it makes it more believable. So that's an option that you may have. So with that, go sit, go to a car dealer. What do you lose? Go to a car dealer and sit in that car that you want. Go to um, a high-priced store and put that watch on or that fur on and get the feeling, get the vibe. Go to that house and that open house and literally go walk through that home. Who knows what could happen? And I can give you a story um, about a lady that I just, I've known her, um, but we've only talked a couple of times. It's at the doctor's office of mine and she's a receptionist and we started talking and she made a comment about one of the things that we were doing and I was talking about my vision board and, and it became a big issue within the office and everybody was starting to show theirs or thinking about doing it and a couple, another person walked in who you know pro was a professional at it and taught how to make vision boards and all of that and I was like where did all of this come from you know which was cool you know and it shows that some people are on the same path well, she said that uh, she started to tell her story and she loved this one particular house that she saw. She had bad credit. She didn't. She wasn't financially able at that particular time to get the property and she didn't know what she could do. So what she did was is she changed the address on her checkbook. Literally changed the address on her checkbook to the address of the home. And believe it or not, she said six months later, she was moving into that property. And she said to this day, she still has no idea how that took place, how that happened. 
how that came into existence. She said, but she believed so much and she started using that address. Now, obviously, nobody was living in the property, but she started using that address and she mentally started preparing herself to move into that property and the vibration changed. The universe opened for her and everything took place. So with that being said, Thomas Amal Conversation Corner, hopefully this is something that'll help you in your day. Hope you uh, will listen to this because I definitely am gonna use it and I think I'm gonna call my former acupuncturist today. Talk to you soon, click the link below. It's time to start making some changes in our life. Why are we procrastinating? There's really no need to. What we need to do is imagine ourselves on all of the beaches of the world. Like I said, what we need to do is imagine ourselves on all of the beaches of the world. Imagine ourselves being able to pay whatever bills and not be worried about bills. Imagine being able to get up and do whatever you want and having the freedom to do it whenever you want to do it. So with that conversation corner, Power Network, Dream Team, see you in Denver in July. Get on now. Sign on now. Join now. Do what's necessary. Get the tickets. Talk to you soon. Conversation Corner.